how to create your own AI podcast. Now, let me show you how to create an AI podcast and I'll tell you what to do. Watch this. Sis, let's talk about what happened yesterday at the club. Oh my God. Did you see those celebrities that were fighting? Like it got to my head and I was like, what? And I started looking all over for you and I'm like, please don't look. Okay. So you actually want to create your own podcast with AI. Yes, you want to use AI characters. There's something I'll tell you. Hi, my name is Rokobuchi. On social media, I teach you how to monetize the social media platforms, how to make money on social media, how to use AI tools. And again, I review AI tools for you. So today I'll be teaching you how to actually use this AI tool to create a podcast. Now, that's not the problem. The problem is not the tool when it comes to AI. The problem is not the tool. AI is not human. AI is a trained machine. And if you don't get to train your machine so well, you'll never get any prompt correctly. You'll never get any image, podcast, or anything anybody is teaching you correctly. A lot of people come to your comment section and say, I tried what you did, but it did not work out well. Yes, your prompting was not correct. AI is all about prompting. And if you don't know how to prompt, you can never get anything correct. I'll be teaching you today step by step how to create a podcast for you to be able to get your characters moving, talking, doing what you want them to say at a particular time. This one talks, this one stops, and this one talks, and this one stops. Step by step. But I want to tell you today that AI is a machine. If you don't get it right, redo it again and redo it again until you get it correctly. Some people say, oh, my image did not come out correct. Yes. Yes. Prompt it again, reprompt. We also prompt. Even the professionals, they reprompt to get it right. Okay, let's go into this. Let me teach you how to create your AI podcast almost free. Okay, do not forget to subscribe. Do not forget to share and do not forget to comment in the comment section. The next AI tool you want me to teach you. Let's go. So first thing that we'll do is we'll come to chat GPT. So this is our chat, our GPT. I'll open chat GPT like so. Now, once you get to ChatGPT, register on ChatGPT. Now, first thing first, I'll show you how to create this image on ChatGPT. And I'll show you how to create this image on another app, which is still a free app. Because some of you will be like, uh, ChatGPT is not free. Yes, you can actually create up to three images or four images on ChatGPT for free. But I'll show you how to create it here, then create it on the other side before we move to the video part of it. So uh, now you write your prompt. I'll paste the prompt here. And I'll leave this prompt down in the description box as well. But you can read it as well on the screen or pause the screen and get the prompt. So I actually said a cozy modding podcast studio. I'll not read all of this because I know you all will read it on the screen. Okay. Now what I said is vibrant 3D pixel. Don't ever forget that. The pixel style. Okay. I talked about two dark skin uh, female characters. So the two dark skin female characters, which I'll still add the... 3d because yes i want it to be 3d by all costs so there i'll just add 3d pixel so let's just add that in as well so like so okay so we have we have that in now uh in their 30s seated face to face at a silk podcast deck now this is it like i said I'll actually create this here and I'll create it on another app for you guys to see. Now, I'll come down here at the end of it and I'll actually still add that they should make the image landscape, okay? Make image. Make image in landscape size, okay? Make image in landscape size. So, we don't get to... Because I want the YouTube format of it. I don't want the TikTok. No, now, if you want it to be the TikTok format or Instagram format, you should just use the portrait mode 9.16. But if you actually want the landscape mode, make sure you put the landscape size and add in 16.9. Okay? The 16.9 is for YouTube. You can use it on Facebook. You can use it on YouTube. But most probably for YouTube and Facebook. Or most importantly for YouTube and Facebook. Now I have our prompt like this. The next thing I need to do now is to click on generate and generate this prompt. So let's click and generate. So ChatGPT takes a little while to generate images. We wait for it to generate. Like I said, you can actually generate up to five free images on ChatGPT for free, depending on your location. Some locations will give you three free images. Some locations will give you four. Some will give you five. 
So I'll drop the script. Let me put it here. That is what I used. You can actually click on that and copy that, okay? Or you can pause and write down this prompt for you to be able to use it as well. Because I know prompting is a problem, but then again, I'll write it in the description box. But if you don't want to wait for the description box, please screenshot this and get it. So we're waiting for this podcast to get done. So you see how the name comes out nicely already? Yeah, name comes out nicely already and I like that. It's a good thing. I like ChatGPT for images. It makes a whole lot of sense. <laughs> so our image is ready. Yeah, image ready. Voila. Voila. All right, so we'll move to the next app where I'll still show you how to generate an image like this. Let me click. I'll copy that, okay? So you see, this is so nice. This podcast makes a whole lot of sense. The image, I'll click on it and I'll save it. So you save, you click on save. Now let's go to the next app where I said you can actually generate your image as well, but then that app is not so perfect like ChatGPT. But yeah, I'll be using Leonardo AI for that so okay now once you get to leonardo ai you click on the plus button please register on leonardo you click on the plus button you click on image gen once you click on image gen where it says prompt here they say type in your prompt i'll click there and i'll type in my prompt which means i just put the prompt from chat gpt now uh, i'll click here on the settings button why on the settings button i'll choose the image dimension which is the 16.9 when I'm done choosing the image dimension, which is the 16.9, I'll come down here. And on this part, I'll just click now on generate because I already have everything set. I'll click on generate. And we wait for that to generate as well. So now I've given you two options. If you cannot use ChatGPT, please use the Leonardo AI. And again, prompting is very important. You might think you know everything when it comes to AI, but you don't know how to prompt, then you fail. That's where your failure comes from, prompting. Okay, when this image is done generating, then we move to the next app where we get to put these images into videos. Voila. So you see this as well, but their 3D is not as the one from uh, ChatGPT. But then again, yes, it is good. You can use it. So yeah, start from somewhere. So when you want to save this image, just click on the image above. You see save, you click on save, and then you save your image like so. So let's move to the next app. So the next app we are going to write now will be the Hydra AI. So I'll actually click on my browser because I'm using it from the browser. I'll click open my browser. So this is Hydra AI. This is how it looks like. Uh, that's the spelling of it down there. You can see, but you need to register on this first. So when you're done doing your registration on this Hydra AI, all you need to do is where it says character, you click on the character, okay? You click on the character, click on image, upload image. So you click on upload image, then you click photo library. It takes you to your library, then you choose the photo you want. You bring in your podcast photo. So you have your podcast photo now like so. Now what you need to do is the second place where you go is add your script, okay? I'll click there. I'll bring in my script, which means I'm bringing in the first script. I'll bring in the first script, upload your script. I'll bring in the first script. I have this one that I already recorded. That's it. Now, once this script is in, sorry, I have to bring it again. Okay. Now, once your script is in like this, you need to listen to this script and make sure it stands well. So first off, I'll try to cut off, drag it like so, because I just recorded it myself on WhatsApp let's talk about what happened yesterday at the club oh my god did you see those celebrities that see is let's talk about what happened yesterday at the club oh my god see let's talk about what happened yesterday okay. at the club so I oh this my god. and then i have it. did you see those celebrities that were fighting like it got to my head and i was like what and i started looking all over for you 
And I'm like, please don't laugh. This is not funny. Stop laughing. Because this was going crazy. Okay. But I did not see so you. So now I have this because I have my audio already good. I know it is good. It might be low, but yeah, it is good. So uh, what I'll do now is I'll just click here on add to audio, which is this one. Add to video. Click add to video. It is there. Now where we have the problem of someone not being able to fix this is the prompting okay where it says at your character prompt now i have to say make the character the character in the pink okay the character in the pink outfit okay character in the pink outfit lip sync lip sync lip sync so the character in the pink outfit will be the one to lip sync the audio okay audio which means the character in the pink outfit we is the character which is who, who is sitting on the right side okay so you have to mention that as well that is where i said prompting matters a lot you have to mention that as well okay so it will be the character in the pink outfit, yeah, the character in the pink outfit, sitting, sitting on the left side, on the right side, yeah, on the right side, on the right side of the table, okay, so now this is how it's going to be. Make the character in the pink outfit sitting on the right side of the table, lip sync the audio. While lip sync the audio and some hand gesture and and make some hand gesture, okay? Make some hand. Um, the first prompting is make the character in the pink outfit sitting on the right side of the table, lip sync the audio and make some hand gestures hand let's not forget hand gestures 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 <laughs> hand gestures hand gestures okay now we have the second one this is now prompt for the second one while the character the character why the character who is sitting who is sitting uh, on the left side, on the left side of the table, yeah, on the left side of the table, laugh, yeah, laugh, uh, laugh, and make some hand gestures. Yeah, hand gestures looking at the other character. Okay, so we have this. This is what I actually made. I did not want to do too much. So I actually said make the character in pink outfit sitting on the right side of the podcast lip sync the audio and make some hand gestures while the character who is sitting on the left side of the table uh, laugh and make hand gestures too click on generate okay we already have it in our image size is 16.9 that's our image size 16.9 our video quality is 17.20 we have it like that okay now everything is set. What I'll do here is I'll click on generate. I need to take a while to generate. Then I'll give you all the results. Okay. So let's wait for it to generate. Click on generate and wait. Now I want to let you guys understand that training training two AI um two AI characters on the podcast is actually very difficult. You might regenerate it the first time, it doesn't sit well. You need to regenerate it again the second time. Okay. Or even the third time to get it right it is ai it is not us it's not a human being so yeah you need to know sometimes not all ai tools are accurate 
you know, they might be accurate, but you need to give them a more help by prompting. That's why I said prompting is just the best thing that you can do for your learning AI. Yeah. Okay. I'll let this generate and then I'll come back and give you the results. So this is the result. <clears throat> now we are done. The video is done generating. I want you guys to watch closely the girl in pink. How her mouth, like the lip sync is perfect. I love it. Just see. Oh my God. Did you see those celebrities that were fighting? Like it got to my head and I was like, what? And I started looking all over for you. And I'm like, please don't laugh. This. So you see, this, this is actually good. Now the first prompting that we did, uh, the lady was not really laughing. Uh, now you need to redo it again if you really want her laughing. Like I'll tell you guys, I'm not here to kid around. Like I told you, AI is nobody's best friend. Yeah, but it's the lip sync of the lady, because this was going crazy, but I did not see you. You see, the the lady's movement is so super. See, let's talk about now. What? You can use it like this if you want. You can regenerate it again, or you can actually give in a prompt for the lady to say, for the second lady to say. Okay. Please, if you watch till now, don't forget to subscribe, don't forget to share, and don't forget to comment. Remember, all the prompts are in the description box below. Ask your questions, and if you want to join my AI school, please join my AI lessons and learn this detail. Okay, let's go.